we've got locks to the left of us, locks to the right of us. We're in the middle of a lock. On with the charge of the Battle of the Light Brigade sort of thing. <laughs> the heavy dragoons are going to go that way. We walked up that way yesterday a bit with the dog. And it's just lock after lock after lock. I'm not in the mood for locks. I'm in the mood for just being reclining mm. in the sunshine. Well, we'll be in the sunshine. I, it, it's pleasant enough here. I mean, basically, we're in the pound between two locks. It's a fairly short distance between them. There's a cornfield over on that side. There's a wheat field behind us. And there's um, lots of boats moored in this pound, which yeah. they're not moored in others, so I don't know what that's So about. we thought maybe this was the nice one to stop in. So, so we, we joined them. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, no, it's been quite pleasant. Um, short walk that way yesterday. We had to save a bunch of ducks. There was a duck going mental outside the lot. And it wasn't really obvious why she was going so mental. No. But the lock was drained halfway. And... I sort of noticed the mental thing, looked over the side, and here's these little the tiny, tiny ones. little tiny, tiny little gays. And there's three of them, and they're freaking out on the inside, and, and mom is freaking out on the outside. The lock was, however, sort of halfway through, so couldn't just open the doors, so Joe went back to get the windlass. But while I was standing there, just sort of supervising, I guess. <laughs> supervising the, the ducks. <laughs> um, she, the mother, uh, uh, sort of flew down in to join them, and then freaked out. Like, she was really, 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 really freaking out. Um, she was trying to get to the sides and stuff, and she just couldn't get through. Then she flew up and went to the other side. The baby started freaking out. So I was like, okay, let's Everyone see what I can do. Everyone stay calm. Here. Everyone stay calm. Supervisor in action. So, uh, so basically, I found out that um, with sufficiently willingness to damage hands, you can raise a lock paddle with your rare hands. Um, it's not easy, but it's not impossible. So basically, I got some calluses, and I... And I got the door open for the duckies, and they were very happy, and they went off, and they were just like, we completely ignore you now, thank you very much. Right, yeah. so off we go to do the locks. Off we go to do the locks. We're on our way? Okay, stopping recording. through Red House Lock which is lock number 13 um, and it says to leave the lock full so Michael's gone out and on 
I'm just waiting for the lock to fill up so I can put the pedals down because it doesn't say to leave the pedals open. It's been a nice day. It's been lovely. And we found a mooring in the shade. We have a mooring in the shade and here's the hilarious part. Our solar panels are in the sun. <laughs> but just the solar panel. It's great. It's perfect. It's ideal. Oh my god, I itch. That's why I'm complaining so much. Yeah, I'm comfortable. Go and have a nice shower. That's a good idea. We're doing this. Well, after this, go and have a shower. Oh, okay, after this. Because I'm not doing this in the shower. It's been a nice day. It's been a pleasant day. It's, the Aylesbury so far has turned out to be Oops. like really quite beautiful countryside. We only quite saw a large number of locks, but... We only saw one boat moving and that was the day boat. Did you hear what the guy said? Oh no, you were a bit further back. The, the woman was like, watch out, there's a boat coming, move over. And he was like, it's okay, we're pirates. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. It's Lots of beautiful dragonflies. Huge dragonflies. Yeah, the one that came on the boat yesterday was like massive. Yeah. And I've seen a whole bunch more of them. All down here, there was like loads of like tall, like you couldn't see the towpath. Yeah. And from the towpath, you can't see the canal. And there's all these tall wild flowers and yeah. there's like lily pads. Lily pads everywhere. Little these, yellow these flowers. Just reams of reeds along the side. You know, very narrow path, very narrow bridges, very narrow locks. But basically just gorgeous. Like, mm. you know, really nice countryside could use it being a few degrees cooler but as always know. it's been pretty easy going there was that one lock that the one i drove into that it was a little bit overgrown on this side so you couldn't line up so you basically had to turn as you were going yeah, into it swing into into line which is it. a bit weird but it was all right yeah they really should trim that tree yeah because um, it was really just a big overhanging tree that that made that difficult but uh and coming out is going to be hard as well yeah because yeah, you won't be able to <laughs> what i'll do that one well, I did it fine. Well, you can do that one on the way out then. We'll forget which one it was. Yeah, and then you'll just hit a tree with your face. Which I just did a few minutes ago, so that's part of the other reason I'm complaining about things. The tree in the face. <laughs> part of the other reason why you've got like bugs and foliage around your face. Oh yeah, I'm sure. You coming on the boat, George? And then I found George a ball that was floating in the canal. So now George has got a squeaky ball. Yes, which he's not normally on. Give me the ball. Get your ball. He's got a squeaky ball. Which is not allowed. No, there you go. So we found this mooring in the shade, and um, I think we might stay here till Sunday morning. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, we've just had a text from Michael's brother, who's in Scotland. And where is he? I'm not actually sure where, but he's, because he, I don't really know where the Kelpies are, but he found the Kelpies, the horses, um, the large sculptures of horses, because not like Scottish people made out of seaweed, which is what you might assume if you don't know what a Kelpie is. Anyway, it, it, it's big sculptures of horses, it's quite beautiful. I read his message before I saw the image and he said he's found a lock and I thought it was being funny and I thought it was going to be like, you know, a Scottish lock. Ah, oh, right, right, right. Yeah. But it was actually a canal it lock. It was actually a canal lock, yeah. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, click, subscribe and uh, hit the bell. Or the speaking talk. to the left of me, engines to the right, yeah, I am stuck in the middle. Well done, George. Well done. Diesels to the left of them, diesels to the right of them, diesels in front of them. Charge of the Pooh Brigade. Oh good, we got that on camera, excellent. On the good side, George has done his business. Joe has done her business. Michael has done his business. I've done my business. Why are we recording stuff go. that's not going to go in the video? Well, that's booper material, isn't it? I'm not talking about poos, even in the bloopers. Who said I was talking about poos? I... <laughs> oh my god! You think I was talking about poos? You were talking about poos, right. Nah. Right, like, I'm, I'm glad that everybody, you know, enjoys us and. And I'm glad this you can keep that off if you want. Yeah. I, don't, I don't care about contingency. Oh man, how bad is my hair? Okay. What, contingency? Continuity. <laughs> Get the language right. <laughs> Fine. Okay, I got my hat back. I think you can keep it off. No, because you don't care about contingencies. <laughs> care about contingencies. Oh, what do I not care about? Uncomfortable. Oh, so much better. Ah. Oh yeah, and there was this one book. Can you pay attention? I'm paying attention. 
seven times in a row he waggled off like right on me <laughs> you know like, wait, wait, so waggle off you mean he shakes himself dry a bit of a mustache or something oh uh, eyelash maybe yeah wag what else what, what, what waggle off me it means Jesus. yes of course it means that he would he would get out and he would do his like um, you know, I'm going to dry off my entire body thing that dogs do, which I am incredibly envious of. The entire ability to do that. So you want to be able to waggle off. <sighs> okay, now it sounds bad. I would like the ability to have the sort of spinal column you need to just be able to go like that and shake all the water off. Like, that would be cool. I love the way it starts when he waggles off. Or when he shakes the water off, it starts in his nose and then it goes down and then the last thing to do is his tail. Yeah, so like, yeah. So it's like in slow motion, it's really funny because it's like nostril, whole head, ears, okay, back, all right, butt, and then just the tail. <laughs> and then, you know, he's done. So. Oh, jeez. Oh, good. Okay. So, yeah, we found this. We thought it was a Shouldn't have given him a shot. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just throw it straight backwards and then just see George <laughs> leaping up. Air. Splash. <laughs> there was a moment's fear that that was what was going to happen. And I'm watching the camera, right? So it's like, here goes the ball. And I just had this image of like, ah! <laughs> Alright, so, thanks for watching. Like, comment, click the dog. Um, and, uh, 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 thanks for watching.